name is Marva Karassi Andor. I'm honored to stand before you. I'm honored to be a daughter of Therix. And honored to be worthy of the stone. Strange. Feel as if I can see you. I was six, I think. First time I touched a funerary stone. Heard our music. Felt our history. Holding my sister's hand as we walked all the way from Fountain Square. Where you stand now, I've been more times than I can remember. I always wanted to be lifted. I was always eager, always waiting to be inspired. I remember every time it happened, every time the dead lifted me. Uh, with their truth. And now I'm dead. And I yearn to lift you. Not because I want to shine, or even be remembered. It's because I want you to go on. I want Ferrix to continue. In my waning hours, that's what comforts me most. But I fear for you. We've been sleeping. We've had each other and Ferrix, our work, our days. We had each other, and they left us alone. We kept the trade lanes open, and they left us alone. We took their money and ignored them. We kept their engines churning, and the moment they pulled away, we forgot them. Because we had each other. We had Ferrix. But we were sleeping. I've been sleeping been turning away from the truth I wanted not to face. There is a wound that won't heal at the center of the galaxy. There is a darkness reaching like rust into, every, into everything around us. We let it grow and now it's here. It's here and it's not visiting anymore. It wants to stay. The Empire is a disease that thrives in darkness. It is never more alive than when we sleep. It's easy for the dead to tell you to fight. And maybe it's true, maybe fighting's useless. Perhaps it's too late. But I'll tell you this. I could do it again. I'd wake up early and be fighting these bastards from the start. Fight the Empire! Wow, what a speech by Marva. Uh, this is more than likely taken uh, around the time that she was still sick, but she probably more than likely fought through uh, the pain and anguish at that moment. But her speech actually reminded me of my Mothma speech back in Rebels. Um, and with Luthen being there, I kind of wonder what his response uh, to this specific speech is there. Well, we, we did see his expression, but I'm kind of curious about that. But mostly everybody heard the speech. It was definitely inspiring and uplifting for everybody here in Ferrix. So, and then we get the uh, the actual revolt from, you know, the people and, you know, we go from there. So, what did you all think of the speech? What do you all think of this moment, the scene and everything, taking it all in? Let's talk about some things in the comment section, guys. And remember, the Force will be with you always.